One day, Thomas was having a nice drink while waiting for the engine to come by with the passengers. But then, the usual engine that came wasn't Henry. Hello, 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 Thomas. It's been a while, hasn't it? Indeed, it has been too long. Thomas wasn't usually friends with Stemney, but now that he had matured, he now felt like he was an actual friend. Hmm, I see that you're more kind, Thomas. What has changed? Nothing has changed, you blue engine. Oh wait, you're not blue. You come for the bluebell, however. How strange! Ha <laughs> There's my classy Thomas! Though, if you were talking to an engine that you didn't know, they might get mad. I didn't offend you. Yeah, like I said, you didn't offend me. That's fine. Okay, good. Anyways, I'll see you later. I had to end this passenger train. Ah, <sighs> what a nice guy that Stepney is. Since Mavis didn't know about Stepney, Thomas was talking about her and him of how similar they were, and some few little stories that Stepney had along. Wow, Stepney sounds fantastic. I'd like to see him one day, or even meet him. Wait, haven't you met before? said Thomas cheekily. Yes, but it was only introductions, not anything else. Hmm, I see. Hmm, tell you what. Maybe I could ask him if he could work with you for a day. While Toby does my jobs, and I do Stebney's. How'd you like that? Oh, I love it. I think it's a great idea. It's settled then. We'll do it tomorrow. The next day, Thomas asked Stepney if he could do Toby's job, while Toby did his, and Thomas would do Stepney's. But Stepney replied bluntly, Are you sure? I heard you and Duck don't like to talk to each other. Of course it's Duck, it always has to be Duck. Thomas whispered quietly, oh, It's fine. I could deal with Dandum Skull. It's only for a day, after all. Well, if it's the case... Then of course! I barely talked to Mavis before, and it'd be nice to see her again. I've heard she's nice. Indeed she is. Now off you go. You need to go work. Same for me and Toby. And so... They both did. Thomas worked well with Duck, but he had a sad time to have a smile on his face, and Duck realized as well. But on the other buffer, Stemney was having a good time with Mavis. And it was different to come back to a dusty old quarry. At the end of the day, the two talked to each other of how it was. Did you have a fun time with Duck? He asked knowingly. It was mediocre. But what I want to know is how was your time? Stemney quickly responding happily. I had a fun time. And Mavis was quite nice. She told me about herself and gave a few little tricks about trucks. I don't think we'll do it again unless I'm needed. Now at least. But it was fun. Good to know. Good to know.